Hello, legends, heroes, and poopy heads. Welcome to the Omni Flash channel, where Omni Flash will take gaming to the next level. So today is a very serious video. I've been getting requests from so many people on how to make gold coins and how to get rich fast. And I'm going to tell you how I became a millionaire selling frog fallopian tubes. That's right. This is the best stuff. If you ever get a chance to eat hazma, you need to eat it. And the correct way of eating hazma is, of course, inside a papaya fruit. Hazma is the most awesome food ever. This food was used by emperors to become super strong. I think they became super saiyan after they ate the hazma. The benefits of hazma includes being protein packed with vitamins and minerals. This will strengthen your internal organs. It will cure ulcers. I think it cures a bunch of respiratory, uh, respiratory stuff. I don't know if it cures COVID. I'm, I haven't tried, but it is also said that this stuff, this asthma, can actually help you restore your strength after childbirth now i haven't had childbirth either but if i did i'm gonna eat some asthma but to be serious asthma is absolutely amazing it is end game mana food okay your other option is snake stew who wants to eat snake stew you want to eat sugary goodness of frog fallopian tubes and it's the same it's like Pasma is cheaper. It's cheaper to snake stew and it has like 25% more mana. So all you got to do is make sure that you set your mana regen at maybe like 75% so that you eat hazma every time you have less than 75% mana. And this way you won't overfill your mana. So it's actually a good deal. You need to try this out. And I and making millions of gold from it every single day i sell a ton of hazma and this this is this is just i mean every day i make maybe 200 300k gold and in the beginning i would make maybe a million gold in a day just depending on how many cooks there are that are cooking hazma and whether or not they know not to undercut each other if you undercut each other you're just hurting yourself if you place your hazma and you sell it at the same price as everyone else you'll make more gold and it's it's the same for everything if you sell your fish at the same price you may not sell it as fast but it will sell and you will make a ton more gold and and these are wonderful customers every day i know everyone uses probably a hundred a hundred mana food every day maybe 200 mana food every day and it's 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 a consumer item you have to use that in order to run your events in order to do your dungeons you need the best food and and hazma's it hazma's the cream of the crop the best that you can get now in order to figure out what life skill you should get i recommend you check out my other life skill guide which still works because it works for every server and if you go and if you look at my life skill guide it will show you how to figure out which life skill you should use all right so a lot of whales a lot of whales decide hey i'm not going to get a life skill it doesn't matter well i mean i know you're a whale but it does 200 to 800k gold a day does that matter i mean it does matter in the long run in my opinion this is this is it life skills is the way to go and for me it is cooking hazma that's my passion i enjoy making frog fallopian tubes for everyone to enjoy and it is it is pretty pricey to get to the master chef level so to get from level 80 to level 90 i think it took about 3.4 million maybe 3.5 million gold 
And from level 70 to level 80, I think that was around 2 million gold. Maybe 2.5 million gold. And from 60 to 70, that took about 1.3, 1.3 to 1.4 million gold. So each time you go up, you do spend some gold. But it is an investment that returns the favor and you make a ton of money that just falls from the sky every day because every day you get action points just by playing the game. When you do Monster Massacre, you get a ton of action points. When you do uh, Phoenix Valley, when you do your Moon Falls, your Dusk Twilight, Whenever you do your cultivation dungeons, when you do your guild events, if it's a guild league, a guild territory war, a guild beast, a guild whatever event, they all give action points, which in return gives you gold coins in your pocket. But you know, at the end of the day, money does not give us happiness. What really matters is that you know that you are serving food that people love and they love it so much you can see it in their faces look at that they're licking the hazma off the table and just seeing how happy they are as they licked the hazma off the table that that's what makes it worthwhile okay so i know making frog fallopian tubes has made me millions of gold coins but that's not the reason that why i became a cook okay i became a cook so i can make people happy all right so do whatever it is follow your heart follow your passions and become the cook the fisher the gatherer and become the best that you can be okay follow your heart and just make sure that you provide value for your customers I just want you to feel the same way I do because every day I go cooking. I knew I know I make some gold coins, but I know I make so many happy customers and they're return customers and that's why they come every day and I see their names as it scrolls through my sold list and I know that they love my hazma because it's not just finger licking good. This hazma is actually table licking good. And that's why people love Hasma, and I love it too. I'm making this video to show you how easy it is to make gold coins. It's not hard. It is the way to go. This is how you make a ton of gold coins. My life skill video that I have linked below in the description and in the first comment will show you which life skill you need to get, okay? It will show you how to analyze the life skills. You need to go through, uh, find out which life skill makes you the most gold coins. And that that's what you got to do. And you, you can't skip this process. It's very important. This this life skill thing is important. You need to do this. And this is how you get super strong. And I can't stress it enough. If you can do this, this will actually make you stronger in real life. If you apply the same decision making that this perfect world crafting system does, in real life, you can make a ton of gold in real life. And it's the same way. So I want you guys to watch this video and become richer, not just in game and also in real life. I also want you to go try some Hazma in real life. And you can comment below and tell me how much you loved Hazma in real life. Of course, I do like my Desert Broom Rape as well. So I do make Flora Poppy as well. But I am partial to Hazma. So, you know, all of you who like Desert Broom Rape... Uh, that's not super important for me. It's your preference. I don't care if you enjoy it. Just give me my frog fallopian tubes and I'm a happy camper, okay? So if you enjoyed this video, please like, subscribe, smash that notification bell so you know when the next video is coming out. And comment below to be entered to win a $25 iTunes or Google Play gift card on June 30th, 2020. Thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next video.